three. Good job by Ingles to help on the double. Shot clock down to five. Paul will just hoist up a three. Now, Ingles is still just. Oh, he's an irritant, I'm telling you. Really I, is. I, I mean, if he played against me, I know that it would not. I mean, there'd be something going on. <laughs> because he, he will agitate you. Williams, one for seven from the field. Thompson blocked by Ingles. Picked up by Clark. Back to Thompson. And Unbelievable rebound. What a play, Rudy Gobert. Williams drives on Ingles. Shut him down, put up his hands. Wild shot. Boy, the Jazz have smothered Reddick the entire series. Well, they do a good job with uh, Ingles on them, the size factor, and then they switch. And the guys who switch out on them take away the shot. Oh, really? Paul tried to yeah. get away with drawing a foul, didn't he? He's part of the Canadian national team. Shot clock down to three. Dunn gets it stripped away by Joe Ingles. Kicks it to himself and some started over 28, 29 games here in the year. Now he can match up with Hayward, and they're not worrying about the size factor. He's off by one. Augustine using the screen. Biombo pitches it out to Fournier. Couldn't find the three-point line. Gordon can. Go to work now. Luke Balmute drops it into DeAndre Jordan. Well, I don't need to tell you how much it changes what Utah does defensively. Blocked out. Championship lineage from his days with the Spurs. Makes a great career with San Antonio and Indiana. Get back to our pace. we got to keep attacking. Ready for three. I think that's got tipped. Son is constantly improving. That must be a very strong relationship. Because sometimes that can be difficult. Along with Molly Sullivan, Abdul Nabi, Mark Sumoff, here at Wilson. Magic can play for the final shot of the quarter. Fournier drives. Oh, he had it taken over. Augustine. That's a screen from Biombo. 19-14, Jazz by five. A little trap. Yep, DJ has got to rotate and rotate that basketball. Reddick bounces to freedom, misses. The Very competitive games against Golden State. Well, they won game three and lost in overtime in game four. There's Griffin with eight on the shot clock. Ingles. Started together for the Clippers for the finish. Save for this guy. Crawford still get a three. You're going to make it. So you're going to be complaining from over here. Right? Here's Reddick driving on Ingles. And they don't give away possessions, but you wouldn't know that tonight. It definitely muted the Oracle crowd thus far. Steph waiting for Gobert to jump at him. Now he gets it back. Shot clock at two. Draymond little push shot and he rims it in. No question about that. I say among the best two. Yeah. I put Durant right there, too. Here comes JJ. Got bumped hard. No whistle. Luke for three. The ball of Diaw early as many times in the middle of the floor to get him to make the play. Redick is second. Long. He really does. Just a calm flow on the court. Ingles chases after Booker. Throws it away. I think that's a good word, Jim. Concentration. As good as Utah is defensively, to have only two turnovers against this Jazz team really says something. And right when I say it. Threw the ball up at him, but now he thought he just got fouled on that place that ended up in a layup at the other end. Reddick finally got open. Pick up, we've talked about it all year. He can score. And what's great about Joe is he doesn't need the ball, but when he does get the ball, he can create, he can pass, and he's one of the best at scoring. Jazz a bit 4-6. 67% from behind the arc here in the opening quarter. Jeff Withy will check in next with select shots around the rim. Up and in. Uh, the, the big debate here in Salt Lake is, is Mac took over the, the backup position, and Dante Exum is now out of the rotation, and he's earned it. And Mac and, and the beard are pushing each other. A little physical. And they're back to a reason now. Three seconds left. Chovich checked back in during that timeout for Biombo. Green 
Augustine Fournier with a shot against George Hill. Reddick in the wing against Engel. Too late turn. JJ 4 3. Lifetime left. They've got all the time they need. They just need to settle down on the defensive end and keep the, keep the ball popping on the offensive end. Just ran a double team. No, why? Because Diaw can get back to Mute out on that perimeter because he knows that he does not want that shot. Oh, oh, oh. Rivers a little bit out of control. One on the shot clock. It's almost impossible not to do it at some point. I mean, come on. We're talking about we're, the, we're broadcasting a game. <laughs> we got to mention free throws. Ilyasova had it batted away. Stauskas finally retrieves. Bender jumps out. Off the lane. Two bigs on the floor for Earl Watson and the Suns. Knight backs it out behind the three line. Good defense by Utah. Deny, deny. Here's Dudley. When uh, the Rook was playing him, they helped him out by doubling him when he got the ball, Joe Jensen. Ten in the shot clock. Eight minutes to go in the game. Pass a little behind Olenek. Neto the other way. Brown with an angle. Neto thought better of it. They get Johnson a three. Playing for Australia. Well, the Celts have uh, Kelly Olenek playing center right now. But Gobert is not playing him. Ingles is trying. Kick to the corner. Five on the shot clock. Horford knows it. Tough fall away. Short. This crowd getting very restless. Rudy tries to protect the paint. It's off the rim. Chandler fires it off to Dudley. Kick it in the corner. Knight. Rebound. 20, no. 20 attempts. It wasn't the best defensive quarter for the Jazz in that third quarter, but offensively still very good tonight. Utah net ranked number one in opponent points. A lot of guy like Diaw, you know that you should cut because layups are the, are the hardest thing to get in the game, but they're the easiest shot. And obviously, Don... Yeah, definitely have the Warriors' attention. Oh, no. Ian Clark, oh, little double yeah. pump. JaVale keeping it alive. And ricocheting out of bounds. You see Coach Quinn just kind of smile. Well, the free ball again. A big part of the Jazz on the offensive side, 53%, 36% on the season. And they've had a nice run. Five for five tonight from the line. Jazz have missed one free throw. They're 15 of 16. And Tucker was out of bounds. Very equal exchanges. I wondered when they would start to trap Chris Paul. Reading. That ball was blocked by. I mean, you lose this game, the series is basically over. So you can get almost two up sometimes. Yeah, you're right. There's a steal. Ingles. Look for Joe Ingles to throw a lob to Hayward. They connect on that play once or twice a game, and it surprises the opposition all the time. This Ingles' is third steal. Maneuvers up the court. Gets then dive back in. Ilya Silva trying to buy him time until he recovers. Got to do it quicker. Boy, Ingles, another steal, and he will he narrowly missed making the playoffs last year. By one win. Yep. One win taken away from really by the... Taken away by Ingles, his second steal of the game. He'll go all the way to the goal, missed the shot. Talked about how his last, his first game steal. Another turnover for Joel Embiid. That's going to bug a little just a turnover here. Joel bringing it over. Darren Collison for Flalo slipped and fell. Nice hustle. And Joe, oh, he dug it away. Oh, yes. Uh, Hayward, showtime. Crowd's going to love this one. Oh, baby. And it's 45 to 35.